survived. We survived another night. Uh, parked next to a Swift driver. Looks like we got a little fog, a little fog going up on the hill. We're about to go up this stretch of highway. Let's go check her out. It is nice and chilly. It's about 28 degrees outside. That's nice and tight. to put on chains guys right here on 395 we got this other driver just making sure the chains get to where they need to go all right guys we got the chains on pain in the butt dude it's not easy putting chains on in a car hauler there's like zero clearance zero basically zero Sheesh. we had to take off that bar otherwise those chains would have been hitting it would have been rubbing and these chains they come in duels they come in they go both on both uh, uh, tires. Oh man, what a day, what a day. Woo. Look at that though, huh? Can you beat that? Not really. All right, we're rolling, just kind of keeping an eye on the chains. God bless you, 395, God bless you. And it starts to hit a little harder, huh? Oh yeah, dude, are we super truckers or what, dude? Come on. Hey bro, come on this side. This side, dude. I need you over here, doc. Flip a bitch, let's get it. Adventure time, huh? El Clampus, El Clampus, Vitus, Bogey 64, whatever that is. Little Bodie, east of this site was located the Little Bodie Mines. Organized in the 1930s, it was composed of five miners or claims, which produced a fine grade ore containing galena, prites, sulfides, and gold valued at 12 to 15 per ton. During its heyday, the mines employed five workers and could produce 30 tons of ore per day. The facilities included a shop, pump, bunkhouse, mill, and settling tank. Water for the milling process was pumped from springs located 300 feet south of the mines. The mine shafts were reportedly 175 feet below the surface and between 100 to 250 feet in length. By the 1940s, the mines began to falter, and soon thereafter, all commercial operations ceased. Most of the equipment, machinery, and buildings were dismantled and sold. Although its existence, although its existence was brief, Little Bodie continued the tradition of being a gold producer started by its namesake, Big Bad Bodie, in the 196th ancient and honorable order of E. Clampus Vitus, dedicated September 13, 2014, 50th anniversary Bodhi chapter 64. All right, that's, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Yeah, I'll well, we'll head around here. So that's about it. E -B -E -C -V Bodhi 64. Why is it four backwards or is it 40? Six is actually 46, right? 46. I don't know. Interesting stuff. Hey, there we go. Look at that view. What's going on? Ah, oh, this drive's taking forever, dude.
So the, it just started snowing, and then this Metallica song came on. Oh yeah, we got a little snow while we're unloading here in Reno. I just got out of the snow. Yes, and sorry I couldn't uh, show myself chaining up the tires. We didn't have time for that. We had to hurry up and go, man. I was so behind already. And then that just, uh, that made it worse for sure. We're here at United Nissan Reno. Oh man, I'm gonna have to go over Donner Pass to get back to Benicia. Uh, we have a load already going back to Vegas, so that's that's always lovely to hear. Uh, but unfortunately, if there's if it's snowing right, if it's snowing down here, oh you bet your sweet patootie, it's snowing on Donner Pass. And then we're gonna have to chain up again. <laughs> It's all good, man. It's all good. Hey, I haven't chained up since I worked for Schneider, so it's like good practice and stuff, yeah? You know? So that's all good. Oh my god, dude, this guy's super sounds like horrible. Jeez. Alright, last car for Reno United <laughs> Nissan. There's so many wrecks out here. Look at this thing. Jeez. Hey man. They say a way a man takes care of his car is the way he takes care of himself. Wonder how that guy takes care of himself, huh? I'll show you something real crazy right now. Watch this. You guys ain't even ready for this. Where do you want this one? Right there? Alright. Back it up, back it up. Let me begin. I don't think I don't think not that thing. Yeah. Oh my god. This thing's crazy. What happened? What happened to this thing? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> when, uh, when, when, when we did this place. Oh, when you guys bought this spot? Oh, uh, rent it. Rent it? Yeah. It's, it's just, it's just yeah, here? They was here this, uh, wow. Yeah. Oh, there you go. I just asked this guy if it's this bad down here. What's up? Oh, yeah, that'll that'll let me know, huh? <laughs> awesome. Right on. Yeah, I was just asking him if it's snowing down here, how bad is it going to be on Donner Pass? He said, "Oh, it's going to be." I'm like, "Like bad, bad?" He's like, "No, shitty." <laughs> it's like, and he said, he said. This will tell you right there. Look at that mountain. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> Damn it. Just trying to go home. Just trying to go home. And, uh, trying to go home. Yeah. All right, well, I guess if we don't, if we don't get to go over Donner Pass, I guess I'll have time to edit some more videos, huh? Look at this snow, though, huh? Bro, oh, winter wonderland, yeah? Woo. I'm just waiting for this dude to come and inspect the cars.
these Audi Q, these Audi e-trons. You know, there's there's no moving this this joystick, whatever. All it is is, boom, now you're in reverse. No sweat. It sounds so crazy. Let's go, mate, come on. Thank you, love. All right, let's go. Why do all the monsters come out at night? Da -da 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 this car is crazy, dude. Guys, this is what we're going to go home with. So we got eight, eight Envision Buicks and one GMC Denali. We got this tucked in all the way up to the belly, pulled it up, pulled it all the way forward. This is how we made height super easy, right? Because we can articulate that number two. Drop the flippers right there. And then this is where we also, this is how you make height too with uh, bigger uh, SUVs on this number four. Because like I said, I go from one, two, three, four, five on the top. That is four. You put that backwards. And then because this has pockets right here, I was able to dump those pockets and then gave that another couple of inches, which brought that down right there a lot more. And then always move your ramps too. These ramps right here, because these things right here, these little ramps, they pull over. But if I had them right here, if I left them up, they would be about right here and uh, we would have problems because then this might meet those ramps and we don't want that. That's it guys. We're headed home. We're dirty as you know what because we just got out of the snow. Look at that. Everything's dirty. We're dirty birds, but we're also money birds. We got money on the truck and we're headed home and we're safe. That's the most important part. Oh, geez, look, they're actually working on the road on the five going south. All right, brand new road coming to you in 2050. Yeah, this road should be done by 2050 for as long as it takes these people to get these roads done. And I literally have no idea what it takes to go into making all these roads and making them proper. But hey, can we make these roads? Can we make this highway like the highway right after Prim to go to Nevada, to go to Las Vegas? Because that road is cherry, sun. That thing is flat as the flat earth. There ain't no bumps or, you know, there's no crazy bumps over there. How do they keep that road so perfect with the crazy Nevada heat? Nevada, Nevada. <laughs> Some people get mad if you say it the wrong way. But hey man, can we make that, can we make this whole five like the road going to Las Vegas from Prim? Thank you, California. All right guys, we're at our, we're at our first drop over here in Vegas. Yeah, we got a little bit of hail. A little bit of hail mixed with a little bit of rain. Shh. All right, let's leg it. We gotta hurry up. Oh yeah. She's raining nice, huh? Ooh, oh, the little hail that is coming down. <laughs> it stings a little bit, huh? It's just hitting my ears pretty hard. <laughs> Is that supposed to be any rain in Vegas? What the heck, bro? <sighs> so funny though, like it's gonna it's raining here, right? But if you go to another part of town, most likely, <laughs> it's not raining. Just raining over here in Hendo. Nobody coming, huh? Okay, I go. Yay! Woo! I feel bad for that guy. He's gotta, he's gotta inspect him, huh? While well, it's raining. <laughs> oh man, sorry. I bring him at the worst time, huh? And I was leaving already. Yeah, and you were leaving I'm already. Home. Damn, Friday, huh? Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, dude, look at that, though, huh? I'm surprised there's no lightning and thunder. Hey, she looks good in the rain, though, yeah? Gee Come on, drivers. Hit that like button if you're down with these purple lights. Hit that like button. Hit it. Hit it good, dude. Woo! Hey, it stopped raining. Not really. I mean, it's still drizzle. Hey, guys. Why did, uh... I got a riddle for you. Why did Snoop Dogg... Why did Snoop Dogg grab an umbrella? For drizzle, baby. Uh, I need a beer. guys don't get here and then they start to check in the cars i don't think this is one of those places where they get started early either so we're just gonna put the at a budget we'll take those down to longo toyota el Monte, el Monte longo toyota where we were just at uh a while ago where we were at on the last video where i had a dead battery on that uh camry so yeah that's where we're that's where we're back that's where we're headed Two, and we'll go three, and we'll throw it right there, did right down there, did. Look at that beautiful morning. It's a beautiful morning. <laughs> it's windy, man. I hope you guys can hear me pretty good. I hope the audio isn't that horrible. That is one of the things I'm gonna be investing in is a mic, is a microphone that's gonna reduce all the background noise like wind <sighs> I hope everyone's having a powerful week so far I hope everyone's putting money on their trucks dog what bro what'd you do bro how'd you <sighs> Houston we got a problem oh my god dude come on back <laughs> What's up, baby? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Drop it off. Damn, blood. All the way from Nat City? Yeah. Nice. Up on Friday. Okay. Yeah, I'm grabbing a load out of here. Go back to Almani Longo. Oh, really? Grab me a load too, man. What's up? Hit them up. Just share the wealth. Share the wealth. <laughs> I barely get any love, dog. I, I thought that was another driver. I, I, I didn't see the stinger from here.